name is Katie Rubin, and I'm the founding artistic director of Theatre of the Oppressed NYC. I started Theatre of the Oppressed NYC because I found that there was not a lot of what we call popular theater going on in the city. So we can stop and think of something, right? We're just playing around. If I wanted to create theater with communities facing discrimination, especially homeless work, things like that that were already starting, I had no idea how to go about it. Spring of 2010, I saw the call for applications for the Artist as Entrepreneur Boot Camp. And I thought, this is fantastic because I can see the work that I want to do. I have a vision and I have no idea how to put it in place. My name is Peter Cobb and I work as a Special Projects Officer at uh, New York Foundation for the Arts. The Artist as Entrepreneur Boot Camp deals with strategic planning, legal issues, financial issues, marketing and networking, and finally fundraising. The main theme of boot camp was that my life goals and my art goals are inseparable. And then the boot camp helped me think about what are the steps I need to take practically to get from one to the other. What distinguishes Theater of the Oppressed is that the people with the problem, the people facing discrimination in a community, get to make their own play and use their own voice, identify their own problems in a play. NYCDC has proved an incredible commitment to the arts and to artists by funding NIFA for a program that trains artists to be the best that they can be as artist entrepreneurs. Every day somebody's calling up and saying, can we start a troupe with this organization? Can we start a troupe with this community? And we're hoping that we can be sustainable so that we can offer this process of creating theater and having this dialogue with 20, 30 communities at a time in New York City. My name is Katie Rubin, and I'm the founding artistic director of Theater of the Oppressed NYC, and I made it here in New York City.